I got it, Doc. 2.8 milliseconds. Good work, Peter. I'd call that a mild success. I'd call that unbelievable. Do you need some help? Yes. Doctor, what's going on? It's become that obvious. My doctors call it a degenerative neurological disorder. Probably caused by overexposure to toxic chemicals in my reckless youth. Sorry, is, is, is there anything I can do? You already are. The worst part is, it only affects the muscles. The mind continues to work, but... it can no longer do. You're the only one who knows, Peter. I'd like to keep it that way. Of course. Uh, if you'd like to seek a position with more of a future... I, I came here to work for you because of what you've got up here. And that's not going anywhere. So neither am I. Oh, Peter, before I forget, I read the most fascinating article. Outlines possible next steps for the neural interface. I'll take a look. Thanks, Doc. Direct interface with the basal ganglia. Exciting, but risky. I don't know, Doc. You'll need a gallium silk array to make it work. Even then, odds of injury are pretty high. Gallium! Genius! Never mind the risks. We'll work them out in time. Doc's really sick. At this rate, he'll lose control of his motor functions within a year. And if we're not careful, an intracranial implant could make things even worse. Even alter his personality. We need to proceed carefully. Hmm. Peter is starting to suspect. He hides it, but I can tell. He's seen my twitch. Notice the decay of my fine motor control. Well, I'm the one who wanted a genius for an assistant. Of course he knows. <sighs> I just need more time. My work can improve millions of lives. Save millions of lives. It can also save my own. I just need more time.
Um, Doc, I'm sorry. My aunt just texted. No worries, Peter. I was thinking of taking a break myself. As soon as I check our telemetry data. Thanks. Thank you again, Peter. Don't know what I'd do without you. I wonder if I could 3D print a web shooter. I can't believe I've never tried that. Cool. Logic controller for the micro cables Doc's been theorizing. These things are awesome. So much more versatile than simple AI that'll improve the prosthetics functionality over time. Welcome to the future. Prosthetic has a tiny brain. Cool. And a little creepy. Doc dove right in with the intracranial interface.
revolutionary, but not a hundred percent stable. We need to refine this design. Did it! Finished.
Hi, May. Let me guess. Running late? Nope, I'm actually on my way now. Have you heard from Miles? No, but his mother said he was coming, so... Good. I'll be there soon. Bye. Calling agent stationed in the Tenderloin. What's your status? Control, APC Bravo. We can help you with Spider-Man. Help the guys who didn't blow up City Hall. Probably feel ganged up on right now. Maybe try not. those Sable agents. Next time, let us hand. Sorry, guys. Kinda gotta see something, do something code. You just made your last mistake, Honk. What the? Does it seriously take this many guys to rob a teenager? Spider-Man. You're the amazing Spider-Man. You're the spectacular Spider-Man. And a few other choice adjectives Jameson uses. Look, that was really brave. But next time, leave the fighting to the pros. Okay? Uh, okay, but what if there aren't any around? Well, you can't just go swinging at someone twice your size. I mean, don't get me wrong. I fight guys stronger than me all the time. But when I do it, I have... Oh, like that time you fought Rhino on the Brooklyn Bridge? That was so awesome. Perfect example. <laughs> If the other guy's bigger, you gotta be quicker. Okay? Okay, but that's it's easy for you to say. I, sorry, I just can't do what you do. All right, put him up. Seriously? Yeah, come on. First thing, don't let the adrenaline get to you. Breathe slow, breathe deep, relax. Hip square to your opponent. Let them make the first move. Now use your feet. When they go off balance, look for an opening. Boom. Like that? Yeah. Yeah, that's it. Okay. Not only this time, just let me have it. Right on the jaw. Okay? okay? I can. <clears throat> oh, sh. S sorry. No, no. No. <laughs> it's all good. <laughs> you keep that up and uh, you'll be fine. All right. Lesson's over. Gotta go. Hey. Uh. Thanks. You know. Anytime.
Just punch Spider-Man. Shelter should be just ahead. Yo, Miles, what's up? Bro, you're not gonna believe this. I just met Spider-Man. What? That's crazy. Hey, did you show him our hacking app? Oh, man. I totally forgot. Oh, you sucked. He totally would've bought it off you, and then we'd be, like, famous. Yeah, I'll show him next time. I, I gotta go. I promised my mom I wouldn't be late. Uh, cool. Later. Uh-oh. Everyone have their IDs out and ready for inspection. Are you kidding me? It's gonna take forever. That drone wasn't watching. I could jump the fence. Do you know anyone by the name of Martin Lee? Have you seen him? Wow, that was too easy. I can't believe Sable systems are unsecure. Maybe I'll send an anonymous tip. Okay, hacking app. Don't fail me now. Maybe I could turn on that siren. <clears throat> okay, let's see. I can go under the gate on the left, or over the scaffolding to the right. Drones? I'm blind. Those things have mounted guns? I can't let them spot me. Okay, I'm in the clear. Phew, that was intense. Oh, hey, Mom. Hi, honey. Did you make it to the thief shelter okay? Uh, yeah, almost there. Miles, you don't have to work at that shelter, you know. You said I did. No, I gave you a choice. Yeah, and I chose this over more therapy. I mean, it was helpful. The guy said everyone grieves in their own way. This is mine. Okay. Sorry. Mom. Yeah? Just because I don't want to talk about it doesn't mean I don't love you. Oh, honey. I love you so much. We'll get through this. Okay? I gotta go. I'll call you on my way home. I'll be back soon, Mr. Punch. Hey, hey, Miles. Pete. Hey, um, sorry I'm late, man. Oh, no, no, I'm just glad you're here. All right, so, um, what can I do to help? Why don't you start just by, uh, getting comfortable with the place. Uh, meet a few people. You know what? Everybody loves coffee. Coffee? All right. And I'll be back in a little while to check on you. Is that cool? Yeah. Oh, don't worry about Mr. Hodges. He doesn't bite. Much. You sure? Coffee? Thanks. Need help? Not unless you know what the hell a quark is. It's a subatomic particle. You know, the building block of protons, neutrons, hadrons? Subatomic? It fits. Good one, kid. Piece of junk. <laughs> oh, hell. Damn hunk of junk. Uh, you mind if I take a look? Huh? Oh, we have a couple of CRTs at school. I know how to fix these when CR what, what? No, no, you just gotta smack it. Got the time. Get it. Go! Or, could be a loose coax cable. <sighs> all right, all right. Be my guest, huh, Mr. Smarty pants. Hey, please, go ahead.
Tributes continue to pour in for Officer Jefferson Davis, the hero killed in the City Hall bombing, as reports emerge that he used his own body to shield others in his last moments of life. Hey, new kid. I'm empty here. Hero. Man didn't do nothing heroic except get himself blown up. Hey, Ernie. I see you've met Miles. He's gonna be helping out around here. You may have heard of his father, Jefferson Davis. Pretty great that even though he's got a lot of stuff going on right now, he decided to come and volunteer. Don't you think? Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Thanks. Uh, listen, kid, I'm, I'm... Sorry about your dad. Come on, Miles. Let's see if Ant-Man needs a hand in the kitchen. Hey, May. I gotta take off, but, uh... Brought some help for you. Hi, Miles. Nice to see you. Well, grab an apron, wash your hands, and I'll show you around. Hey, hey Peter. Um, thanks for that back there. Of course. Almost noon. Sable should be moving Dr. Michaels. Better get to the Bowery and locate him. I'm afraid our computers are a bit outdated. Oh, that's cool might be able to improve their performance. So how's it going with your daughter, Eileen? Slow. I made mistakes raising her. Hard to get past. If you're talking, there's hope. Don't give up. Now that's a wise man right there.
Hey, Yuri. I'm heading to the Bowery to make sure Michaels gets to his new safe house. You know, safely. I wouldn't do that. Silver Sable made it clear you are not welcome. Yeah, well, what you gonna do? Shoot me? Honestly, 50-50 chance. Ah, uh, fine. I'll be in the neighborhood, but not too close. Just in case. We're ready for you, Dr. Michaels. Is that the devil's breath? It's called GR-27, not... Just be careful. In the wrong hands, this could... Don't worry. We're the best in the world. I feel better already. Code 381. Package is on the move. This way, Dr. Michaels. What the hell is that? Welcome aboard, Doctor. Get off me! We got this! Yeah, sure you do. I'm in pursuit of Martin Lee. I think he's got Dr. Michaels and the Devil's Threat. Copy that. Four units coming your way. He took Michaels alive, so that's good. Probably so we can force him to make more Devil's Threat. <sighs> I have to stop that truck. Tank, whatever. the guys in the trucks before I go after Lee. Keep shooting! Hey! Stop shooting! and he will destroy all sinners! Sorry! Lee, hand it over!
repeatedly. Working on it! I'll take this! What are you doing to me? Giving you a new perspective. What the hell? I must be honest. I was hoping to bring you here. My abilities lend me a certain persuasiveness. I've been watching you. I was waiting for you at City Hall. You never came. Where were you? Is this real or in my mind? It was a shame so many had to die with no heroes to save them. That officer saved your life, didn't he? He was here because of you. And Norma wanted to use him. A futile gesture in the end. And where was Norman during all this? Slinking away like a rat. He knew what was going to happen, and he fled. Norman is a hidden cancer on this city. He must be exiled with no trace of his corruption to return. Norman hides behind his mask of lies. I will break it apart and drag him into the light. Put on the mask. Become one of us. Thanks, but no thanks! One way or the other, you will join me. Uh -oh. Souls you've lost! The innocent victims you couldn't save! Martin! Their blood is on your hands! You can stop Osborne! You have so much strength! I can give you will!
You okay? Did they take it? Yes. How worried should I be? Very. You're a popular guy. Where is the serum? I'm gone. The Diskoya. So-called superhero. You think you save people, but you just make it worse. This is your fault. My fault? He was under your protection. You really need two of those? Stop! We need to brief Mr. Osborne now. I'll go with her. Thank you. I'll remember this. Yuri, tell me you've got a lead on Martin Lee's location. We have footage from a guy at a coffee shop. Looks like he hopped into a black sedan after the crash. Black sedan, great. Let me finish. We have a partial plate. And one of my patrol guys just found a matching plate. Black sedan in a parking lot near Canal and Hudson. You're a good cop, Yuri. I'm on my way. Spider-Man. Hello? Is this working? Dr. Michaels? How are you calling? Borrowed one of Sable's radios. Listen, transit hubs are the most likely release points for Devil's Breath. Airports, bus terminals, train stations. It'll spread like wildfire from there. Why the hell is Oscorp developing a bioweapon in the city? Shouldn't this be in an Arctic bunker? Devil's Breath is personal for Norman. It's been his obsession for decades. The project breaks every state and federal regulation on the books, but he doesn't care. If the city finds out, he can kiss re-election goodbye. Never mind re-election. He'd be tried in The Hague for war crimes. Why are you telling me all this? Aren't you just as culpable as Norman? Yes. Completely. But Lee's actions have been a wake-up call. We've ignored the project's risk for too long. I trust you, Spider-Man. You're the only one trying to do the right thing. Please, protect the city from our mistakes. Looks like the bomb guy's M.O. Only this time he's using a drone to seed spy cams around the city. I better round him up and take down that drone. There's the drone! <laughs> Show's over.
seconds. Now I can catch the drone. Man, I was too slow. There's the drone. Show's over. There's the drone. Show's over. Gotta move faster. Could have done better. Not bad. You got skills. I got skills too. 
And I thought robocalls were obnoxious. Well, I shut down his spy cams. Thanks, creepy stalker guy. You can call me Taskmaster. Because you keep leaving me tasks? That's kind of on the nose. There's a group of mercenaries committing crimes across the city. These mercenaries wouldn't happen to be your mercenaries, would they? No. All I know is they're getting paid well for their work. Unless you stop them, that is. What's in it for you? I get to watch and learn. Spider-Man, we just caught a sniper stalking Mayor Osborne's chief of staff. I'm pretty sure there are other targets. Our perp had a map of the city with the courthouse circled. I'm on it. See if you can get more info out of our friend here and contact me at this number. I need to hurry. The attack on the courthouse could come any second. Sniper sees me near the target, he'll take the shot. Only chance is to take out the gunman before he can fire. Nobody likes a camper. Spider-Man! We accessed the perp's phone. Found more names and locations. Looks like it's all going down within a matter of minutes. No pressure. Send me what you got. Multiple snipers, one Spider-Man. I need to move fast. Anyone who's ever worked on Norman's campaign is a potential target now. That's one way to destroy Osborne, I guess. I guess nobody wants to be around him. Place. Now where's the assassin? Can't go near the top. One down, two to go. Check out all possible vantage points for snipers. 